Hello chat. Welcome to a video. You're on a video right now. Say hi to YouTube. Hello specifically. Fourth commenter in the comments. Hello to you specifically. You, number four. Not number one, two, or three. Number four. That one. Just them. We are gonna learn how to pronounce basically the Chinese names in the Xianjiao Liufu. I believe that's how you say it. I didn't watch this video yet, but that was my guess on how you would say it. We got my boy in the back. I picked the dude because there's not enough men in this game. We're gonna watch Ying's video together. Yeah, the Shinjo pronunciation game and meanings. It'll be fun. The first time I met or even knew about Ying at all was from the Genshin Impact pronunciation guide video. So this is kind of fun to just come back to right now and hear it all over again. All right. Boo! It's time. A lot of Jump scare. Perfect. Good. So the best is how you do the YouTube intro gig. Perfect. People Good. have been asking me for a pronunciation guide for Honkai Star Rail, especially the Xinzhou characters. I get it. Because I've been playing through Sumeru recently in Genshin and I feel your pain. And because I deeply relate to your inability to pronounce character names. I know some people don't feel bad, but some people do. I get ya. I feel really bad when I cannot say a Sumeru name properly. So this is for you. There are timestamps at the bottom if you want. When I feel bad about saying the name wrong, you know what happens to me? I start to sweat and I feel really, really embarrassed when I say something wrong. All of our usual disclaimers apply. Um, Mandarin pronunciation, again, is not constant. There's a standard one as set by the Chinese government. Very political, not gonna get into it. Don't want my family disappeared all of a sudden, so. Huh? What? <laughs> <clears throat> okay, everyone be on your best behavior, okay? So for those of you who don't know, there are four main Chinese tones. Quick recap. The first is ah, uh, it goes flat. Second one goes ah, uh, it goes upward. Third one goes ah, uh, down and then up. And the fourth one goes ah, uh, straight down. And of course, because- Say that with me, chat. Say it. Say it now. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. <laughs> No, Sim, you're not Kek W, you're supposed to say ah. If you have any questions or addendums to add, go ahead and put them directly in the YouTube comments. So thank you very much. Leave a comment, guys. Now. This is a threat. Now. Leave a comment in there now. Not even a request. This is now. We'll start first with the Xianzhou Lianmeng. Xianzhou Lianmeng. Xianzhou Lianmeng. Lianmeng? Is that how you say alliance in Chinese? I didn't know that. Lian. Meng. Xianzhou. Xianzhou. I'm going to say that one a lot. So you say Xianzhou. Xi. Oh. Oh, that's great. They actually put that. Xianzhou. 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 Xian. 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 Xianzhou. Wait, what? Then, say that again? And then the Zhou was kind of like the DR in drive or drool. <laughs> so Zhou. 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 Go with the zh 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 sound. <laughs> Meaning wise, I, I've been joking with Chad. I literally call it God boat because Xian means like celestial or God like figure, right? So Xian is God and Zhou is boat. So it's the God boat. <laughs> but if you want to give it a more poetic name, you can call it the celestial vessel. <laughs> the celestial fleet. There's so many boats in this thing. Yang. They're all boats. You can call them. <laughs> I have no idea though. To me, like a bunch of boats together make a fleet right so the celestial fleet holy no <laughs> you don't want to mess up the tones too much because for example if i said xianzhou that would mean salty porridge xianzhou xianzhou not xianzhou say <laughs> xianzhou <laughs> okay xianzhou not xianzhou xianzhou first tone luo fu both second tone. So first time. Luo fu. That's easy enough. Xin zhou luo fu. Does that sound correct? Xin zhou luo fu. Maybe be a little bit careful with how you say luo fu because uh, as chat pointed out, you mess, mess it up a little bit and you got xin zhou dou fu. <laughs> okay, personally to me, I don't know how you go dou. Dou. You go luo. I don't know. My tongue makes a different shape when I say it. Close enough. Xin Xin zhou. Xin zhou. Luo fu. Is that right, Ying? If you're watching this, grade me in the comments. Oh my god. Jing Yuan. Jing Yuan. Third tone and then second tone. Jing Yuan. Jing Yuan. Jing Yuan. Jing Yuan. I think it was like that, was it? Don't copyright claim this. No. Yan Qing. Yan Qing. Yan Qing. Now I see this quite often, actually. Through Yan Fei, Yan Qing, but a lot of 
English, I've noticed people always go yan. So they go yanxing or yanfei. I noticed people do that, but you're Chinese and you're doing really well. Yes! Yin, xing. So it goes down. Yin, xing. Yin, no. So there's a, 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 a. So yanxing. 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 It's like, whatever. Yanxing. I'll try it. Yin is kind of like elegance. And Xing is kind of like uh, like an honorific or like for for like a, a government official, I want to say. But I think it's like elegant something, a, a respectable elegance, something like that. So Do you guys remember what Yinqing looked like in Hongkai Impact the Third? Actually, just so you're aware, what they were supposed to look like. This is what happened to my boy. That's what he was supposed to look like. That's Yinqing. What did they do to him? I'm not kidding. That's Yenxing in Impact the Third. Beard? Scar right across the face? Oh, Yenxing. and then the other thing is the the A-N here. Yin. Yin. I think a lot of people have a tendency to say Yan. Oh, thank God Ying explained it. Thank God. Okay, <laughs> okay hang on. Hold on. Yenxing. Yenxing. Is that correct? Am I getting it correct? Is this correct, chat? Yenxing. Yenxing. It's like I'm throwing my sword down and cutting across. Like, psh, psh. Yenxing. I think that's how I'm doing it right now. Bai, second tone. Lu, fourth tone. Bai lu, bai lu. Bai lu. It literally means white dew. I think this is one of the easier ones to pronounce so we can spend longer on the meaning. Thank you, Ukube. Next up, ting yun. Hey, whoa, whoa. So, bai lu. Bai goes up and then down, right? Was it? Is that how it was supposed to go? Bai lu. Bai lu. Okay, easy enough. Next up, ting yun. Ting yun. Oh my god. What? Ting yun. Ting yun. Is that correct? Ting yun, ting yun, ting yun. I think. Uh, I think you guys remember when I said like jue yun or chong yun in the Genshin pronunciation videos. It's it's the same yun here. It means cloud. Oh okay. Yun, 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 yun. Next up we have su shang, su shang. Oh, so it goes down. I was always said su shang, so it's su shang. What is the a supposed to be? There's nothing there. Uh oh. Is it flat? Like ah. Uh, so shang kind of like su shang is that correct help me i'm scared <laughs> i don't want the wrong information i just noticed ying's wearing blue and i'm wearing red haha <laughs> no that wasn't meant to be no i didn't mean for that to happen <laughs> fire and ice more, more like I, water Ying's were like air you let amber real <laughs> The SH sound is probably the hardest part. Sh, shang, shang. Oh, I see. So you, there's a retroflex in there. Your tongue is like, like make that kind of noise. The uh, American rough, rough and ready. Rough and ready is an island in, I think it's an island. I think it's like an old prison kind of thing in, I think it's Stockton, California. I know why. I'm not going to say why, because that would reveal what I do. <laughs> Su, shang, shang. Su, shang. So people are gonna call her Susan. No, <laughs> Susan, everyone. It's Susan now. Xing Chue is our next one. Xing ah, this is for braxophone here. Braxophone. This is the one you need to learn. Now this one, I had no idea how to say when I first heard it. And I'm actually really impressed that the English voice cast said it correctly too. Like if you have your game in English, you're saying it as how it's supposed to be said. Xue, Xing. To the best of their ability, of course. And it literally just kind of means blue bird. Speaking of Xing Chui, she's one of the best characters I've run into so far in Star Rail. If you need, if you're doing the lore, get to where Qing Chui is. She's so fun to like hang out with. We respect her work ethic or lack thereof. <laughs> this sussy man, Luo Cha. That should be easy enough. Luo cha. I just realized there's luo fu and now there's luo cha. Is there a reason for this? Mr. Auto Apocalypse look like ever in my life. <laughs> luo cha is the alias he uses while on luo fu. Is the luo like the same character or is it different? Luo cha. Luo cha. Second tone and then fourth tone. Um, the meaning is it's it's quite literally it's like a like a demon in Buddhist. Might also be Chinese word for raksha, which is Sanskrit and has a lot of Buddhist Hindu context for the reason the raksha. Isn't this, I think this name is used in Impact the Third as well. I'm sure it is. It is, yes. Okay. Fu Xuan is the next one. Fu Xuan. Fu Xuan. 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 Yes, Raksha is an auto alias back in the day. Oh my gosh. Specifically, he got the Raksha nickname from Sushang. 
Wait, really? Su Xiang knew auto in HI3 as well? Okay, hang on. Fu Xuan. Fu Xuan. Xuan. Fu Xuan. Yu Kong. Yu Kong. Are they saying Wu or Yu? Yu Kong. Yu Kong. Yu is a really hard sound for people. I get it. So just say Yu. You're okay. No! I want to say the. I don't actually mind too much. Yu <laughs> Kong. <laughs> Yu is a really hard sound for people. Okay, it sounds like you, but it sounds more like you. Like you're dropping the Y completely out of it. So it's more like you kong. Not not you, but you kong. I think it sounds like that. Maybe you kong. It sounds more like you. You kong. That's what I'm hearing. You. Like there's no Y sound in there at all. It's very silent, very subtle. Oh, it's more like e. Oh, more like you kong. Maybe you kong. Yu Kong, Kong, Kong. It's very ooh, ooh sound. Kong. I think someone in Ying's chat said the same thing that they were German, so the sound was easy for them. Ah. The one thing is, don't say Kong, say Kong, right? Kong. Kong. Do the long Kong. O sound. So Yu Kong, Xue, Yi, Xue. Oh, I just met this character. She looks like Ran from Bang Dream. Xue, Yi, Xue, Yi. It's the third tone and then the first tone. But similarly to the earlier note I made about the, the tonal combinations making it sound a little different, no one actually says right? Like everyone just goes yi, So you kind of go low high, low high. yi. The only difference is the e doesn't go yi, right? It's not shui yi. It's shui yi. It literally means shui, it literally means snow, and e literally means clothes. It's North Face! <laughs> if anyone has a deeper meaning to that name, by all means speak up. For I'm not gonna look at North Face the same now. <laughs> Promise I would save Blade and then Hung for the end. We'll do Blade first because he's a little easier. I don't super know. I know Blade isn't technically out in the game yet as of this recording. His name in Chinese is Ren. I just wanted to point out that it's a very edgy name because the Ren is literally Ren. the edge of a blade. So it's like a very literally edgy name. Ren. That's all I wanted to say. And then of course the Dan Heng. Dan Heng. And then Dan Heng. Dan Heng. The Dan here, I just want to call out, it's dan not Don. Heng. Right, it's not D-O-N, it's Dan. Dan. Ah, kind of an ah sound. Let's do a really fast speed run. You ready? Xin Zhou Luo Fu. Xin Zhou Luo Fu. Is that correct? Xin Zhou Luo Fu. Jing Yuan. Jing Yuan. Yan Qing. Yan Qing. Bai Lu. Bai Lu. Ting Yun. Ting Yun. Su Shang. Su Shang. Qing Chue. Qing Chue. Luo Cha. Luo Cha. Fu Xuan. Fu Xuan. Yu Kong. Yu Kong. Xue Yi. Xue Yi. Dan Heng. Dan Heng. That's it. That's what about Blade? Where's Blade? <laughs> Blade, 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 blade for <laughs> As far as I know, there are only two Chinese based eons. Aeons? Lady. Aeons? <laughs> yeah. We just saw him, it's fine. Xian Zhou Luo Fu. Xian Zhou Luo Fu. Jing Yuan. Jing Yuan. Yan Qing. Yan Qing. Bai Lu. Bai Lu. Ting Yun. Ting Yun. Su Shang. Su Shang. Qing Chue. Qing Chue. Luo Cha. Luo Cha. Fu Xuan, Fu Xuan, Yu Kong, Yu Kong, Xue Yi, Xue Yi, Dan Heng, Dan Heng. That's it. That's the whole thing. Eight out of ten, passable Ukobe. Eighty percent. That's at least a B in North America. <laughs> so we'll go over those two. The first one is Yao Shi. Whoa! Who Yao the hell is that? Yao Shi. Yao Shi. The next one is Lan. So Lan is the eon representing Lan. the hunt. Lan, I think is pretty Lan. easy to pronounce also. I'm going to call again attention to the Lan. A sound. Lan. 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 And we'll revisit this in a few months for an addendum and an update video. So thank you for watching. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Did you pass class? Well, thank you, Ukobe. And who was the other one? I missed. I saw you. You showed up every once in a while. <laughs> uh, thank you for re-verifying my pronunciations. 8 out of 10, I think, is very good. For me, who does not speak another language, I only speak English. And, like, a very, very, very little bit of French. Just, like, very little bit. But cool. Alright. I feel better now about my pronunciations. If you guys want to go check out the video, links in the description below. Probably pinned right in, like, the, ca the, the thing, the annotations at the end of the video. You'll find them there, too. Go sub the Ying, sub the Me Too, it'll be fun. And just have fun.
Don't worry about it. If you say it wrong, no one's going to go after you. Maybe someone might, but don't worry about it too much. Yeah, watch Ying's video and subscribe. I don't know what, what are you doing here? Why are you watching my video? Sub to me and Ying, yes. That's the end of the video. Bye chat, say bye bye. What did I do? Don't worry about it. Nothing illegal. Might have had something to do with the Tomodachi baby life video. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. But why? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, you guys. Don't worry about it.